In the Jets' latest loss, a 54-13 defeat against the New England Patriots, they managed fewer than 300 yards of total offense, averaged 2.7 yards per carry and didn't score first-quarter points for the sixth consecutive week. They surrendered their most yards in a game since 1998, and allowed their most points in a game since 1995. And to former Jets head coach Rex Ryan, the output from current coach Robert Sala's team was a complete embarrassment. In a Monday appearance on ESPN's Get Up, Ryan said that there's no passion, there's no nothing to the 2021 edition of the Jets. You saw a team that knows what the hell they're doing, the coaching staff with a rookie quarterback, the New England Patriots, Ryan said. Mac Jones, looks like a seasoned pro. You look at the other side, you've got a horrendous coaching staff with a quarterback, Zach Wilson, that looks 100% lost. The Jets haven't made the playoffs since Ryan last coached them there in 2010, managing just one season above .500 in the last 11 years. Sunday's loss directed their current season's trajectory further and further away from the postseason. It was a primary problem for the Jets to address during their bye week, but their first drive still stalled as if nothing changed. There were consecutive runs, then a sack, and then a punt. That is 100% on coaching, Orlovsky said. You spend a whole week studying game tape. You figure out your first 15. You should have some offensive success. The Jets' offense took another huge hit with Wilson leaving the game early on. He will miss the next two to four weeks with a PCL injury, leaving the offense in the hands of Mike White, who made his first career NFL appearance on Sunday, and Joe Flacco, whom the team traded for Monday. Their first test without Wilson, as well as their next chance to snap the streak of scoreless first quarters, will come on Sunday when they face the Cincinnati Bengals, a top-10 defense based on yards and points allowed per game.